What's up guys? I hope everybody's having a great day. Um, this video is going to be a little bit different. Um, because I decided basically that I was just going to, I was taking my videos too seriously so I was just going to have fun with it. Um, so, it's a little strange. Bear with it. Um, and hope you guys enjoy also. Yo, you'll see in the video. You'll see what happens in the video. Hope you guys enjoy. Walmart, the happiest place on earth. We got the Karen. About to be a good day. We got the Crocs. Check. Very important. You know I had to flex on you with the AP Euro shirt. Shout out Mr. Colada. How do I look? Man, I don't care how y'all think I look. I know I'm cute. Ha! <laughs> What's a hunting trip without Circle K? You just can't beat a rain and an unripe banana. I seem to have cut myself since leaving the home and getting the Circle K, so I don't know if I can go on. Nah, I'm just playing. We wild and. I was off the list. I was calling the same. What I What's up ladies and gents? We are finally back at it in the woods, baby. In the woods, gang. But, anyways. It is a, it's a very special day. Because I am done with final exams. Finally. This week has been hell. To say the least. But. But, um. Plan, plan for today, all right? It is December 4th, Friday, December 4th. We have got us some Walmart corn, baby, in North Carolina. It is legal to bait. So for any of the viewers that, that are not from North Carolina, it is legal to bait here. I don't typically hunt over corn, personally, either because I'm hunting public land or just because it's not really something that I enjoy doing. It's it's filling the freezer time, so. I know where, where I'm gonna put it. There's deer moving through that area all the time, so. Hopefully, they'll move through there tonight and be like, oh, look at there, there's some corn. Yum. But I'm gonna go ahead and go. It is about 3.20, 3.20, so. I'm not gonna have super long time to hunt till dark, but we're going to uh, going to get in there and see what happens. Hey buddy, come here. It's okay. Oh no. Come here, bud. Come on. Come here, buddy. It's okay. It's okay. Hey, it's okay. It's okay, bud. It's okay. Hey. Hey, buddy. Hey, are you all right? You lost? Yeah, she looked like she'd been lost for a while. Come here, come here. It's okay. It's okay. Come here. It's okay. 
Hey baby. Are you alright? You need some help? She's following me, but she won't let me get close close to her. But let me just hopefully try and gain her trust somehow, I think. So I'm leaving my truck here. I'm gonna walk back to the camp because we might have some food or some water that I can get her. We definitely got water. In a bowl. Come on, baby. Come on. She's just following me because she's pretty lost. Are you leading the way now? I think I can probably get her some water back at the camp and she might trust me or get close enough to me to where I can get her her information so I can call her owner and figure all this out. Yeah! Yeah, look, you got civilization here. We'll get you tidied up. Come on. Come here. What's up guys? I'm back at, at the truck sitting here about to, about to head on home, but the owner came and uh, we got his dog back to him safe and sound. Apparently she had, she had gotten out of her pen somehow and he thinks it happened this afternoon, but she's looking real thin. I'm not sure if it happened. I, she, she could have been gone for a while. He, he said he's he runs dogs and she was a hunting dog and so he's got a lot of them penned up but anyways got her got her back to her owner and it was the right thing to do for sure like the moral of the story do the right thing I very easily could have just ignored the situation and gone on with my aunt you know um, and there were a couple people that while I was trying to get close enough to her to, to call the number on a collar. There were, I mean, trucks driving by me, like, not not even asking what, what what's going on or whatever, but, but the moral of the story is do the right thing, man. Um, it's safe to say that I didn't hunt tonight, and that's fine. My immediate goal was trying to get that dog back to her owner and uh, that that goal was accomplished so we got corn on the ground out here and i set up a camera so i think deer would probably start filtering in there in that spot in the next uh in the next couple days and i'll be back to hunt it hopefully sunday two days from now but well that's going to be it for this episode and i hope you enjoyed and i hope everybody has a great day peace and love